Hello friends and my dear students. This is your Yoga Anandam Biology Lecture from Medal Academy YouTube channel. In this class, we are going to discuss uh, there are uh, 50 courses from Botany full syllabus. As for the new pattern from section A, we are going to discuss 35 questions and from section B, 15 questions. So totally we are going to discuss 50 questions with detailed solutions. Let us discuss the question and answer one by one. Question number one. Select the incorrect match from the following. The tiger, zoological name is Panthera tigris, is a member of the family Felidae, Canis, Ursus, etc. Belongs to the family Canidae. Families Felidae and Canidae falls under the order Carnivora, Solanum, Petunia and Datura belongs to the family Solanaceae. Families Convolulaceae and Solanaceae come under the order Polymonials. So the incorrectly matched one is option D. Question number two. Under favorable conditions, somatic cells store food material which become thick walled structure and are called as. Under favorable conditions, somatic cells store food materials which become thick walled called echinites. They germinate to form new filaments and colony. So the answer for this question is option B. Echinets. Question number 3. The thaloid body of slime mold is known as. Slime molds are sapropytic protist. Under suitable conditions, they form an aggregation called plasmodium, which may grow and spread up to several feet. So the answer for this question is option D. Plasmodium. Question number 4. Which one of the following organism is not an example of unicellular eukaryote? Euglena, Goniolax and Amoeba are all unicellular eukaryotes. E. coli is unicellular prokaryotic bacterial cell. So the answer for this question is option D. E. coli bacterium. Question number 5. In which group of plant kingdom gametophyte is dependent on sporophyte? In gymnosperm, main plant body is diploid sporophyte because of the plant body is differentiated into roots, stem and leaves which produces small gametophyte which is not free living and independent structure and it is dependent on sporophyte for development and nutrition. Male gametophyte is pollen grain which is liberated after its germination and female gametophyte is endosperm which remain on the sporophyte before and after fertilization. So the answer for this question is option D. Gymnosperm. Question number 6. Which of these plant is correctly matched with its reproductive characteristics? Here there are four sentences are given. Go through the sentences carefully. Sphagnum is a bryophyte. In bryophytes, a male sex organ is called as anthridium, produce biflagellate anthrozoids, while the female sex organ called as archegonium produces a single egg. Sequoia is a gymnosperm. In gymnosperm, one of the megaspore enclosed within the megasporangium develops into multicellular female gametophyte that bears two or more archegonia or female sex organs. Wolfia is an angiosperm. It is an example for smallest flowering plant. Angiosperm showed double fertilization in which one of the male gamete fuses with the egg to form zygote while the other male gamete fuses with the diploid secondary nucleus to produce the triploid primary endosperm nucleus. Polysyponia is a red algae, belongs to the family Rhodopisiae. In Rhodopites, sexual reproduction is uh, hoogamous with non motile gametes and accompanied by complex post fertilization developments. So, the answer for this question is option D. From the given four statements, all the four statements are correctly given. Question number seven Which one of the following statements is correct? Tulips are most popular and widely grown flowers. Tulips are bulbs possessing modified stems and leaves. 
So the answer for this question is option D. The flower of tulip is a modified shoot. That is the correct statement. Question number 8. Which of these properties are seen in Hibiscus rosa sinensis? It is commonly called as China rose. Here there are uh, four sentences are given. Hibiscus rosa sinensis, commonly called as China rose, has axial placentation. It has polycarpillary, syncarpus superior ovary with the hypogynous flower. It has an alternate type of pilotaxy in which a single leaf arises at each node in an alternate manner. It has twisted estivation in which one of the margin of the petal overlaps that of the next one and so on. So the answer for this question is option C. From the given four statements, first and third is correctly given. Question number 9. Two chief functions of leaves are so you all know leaves generally carry out photosynthesis and transpiration. Photosynthesis and transpiration both are equally essential process because photosynthesis helps to maintain the equilibrium position of oxygen and carbon dioxide in the atmosphere and transpiration maintains the atmospheric temperature. So the answer for this question is option B photosynthesis and transpiration. Question number 10. Identify the correct statement with respect to secondary growth in dicot roots. In dicot roots, the vascular cambium is completely secondary in origin and it originates from the portion of a pericycle tissue. The pericycle is a cylinder of parenchyma or a sclenchyma cells that lies just inside the endodermis. Corcambium or pelogen originates from the outer layer of cortex epidermis and also from pericycle. It gives rise to pellum or cork on the outer side and pelodum or secondary cortex on the inner side. So the answer for this question is option C. So from the given four statements correctly given A and C about dicot roots. Question number 11. Ribosomes are the particular about 200 Armstrong units in diameter consisting of protein and RNA. The percentage of protein and RNA in eukaryote is Chemically, ribosomes are made up of ribosomal RNA 60% and protein 40%. These are known as protein factories as these are the sites for protein synthesis. So the answer for this question is Option D 40% and 60%. Question number 12. Which one of the following does not differ in E. coli and Chlamydomonas? Although E. coli is a prokaryotic cell with a peptidoglycan cell wall and Chlamydomonas is eukaryotic with a cellulosic cell wall but they have cell membrane as a common structure which is essentially the same and it is made up of phospholipid bilayer. Other components as mentioned above namely ribosomes, cell wall, nuclear organization differ in these organisms. So the answer for this question is option C. Cell membrane does not differ in E. coli and chlamydomonas. Question number 13. A small aquatic plant was put in each of the petri dishes X and Y containing different culture solutions. After 6 weeks, the plant in a dish X had the same number of leaves as earlier and all leaves were small and yellowish. The plant in dish Y had more leaves of normal size and dark green color. Which one of the following set of elements would be missing in the culture of dish X? The types of deficiency symptoms shown in plants include chlorosis, necrosis, stunted plant growth, premature fall of leaves and buds and the inhibition of cell division. Chlorosis is the loss of chlorophyll leading to yellowing in leaves. This symptom is caused by the deficiency of elements such as nitrogen, potassium, magnesium, sulfur, ferrous, manganese, zinc and molybdenum. So the answer for this question is option A. Magnesium, potassium and nitrogen. 
क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर्टीन दि ट्रांसलोकेशन आफ आर्गानिक सोल्यूट्स इन दि सी ट्यूब मेबर इज सपोर्टेड बै दि एक्सेप्टेड मेकानिसम यूज फॉर दि ट्रांसलोकेशन आफ सुगर फ्रम सोर्स आफ सिंक इज कॉल आज प्रेषर फ्लो हईपोथि दि मूमेंट आफ सुगर इन दि प्लोम बिगिन अट् दि सोर्स वेर द सुगर्स आर् लोडेड दट मीन आक्टिवली ट्रांसपोर्टेड इन टू दि सी ट्यूब loading of phloem sets of water potential gradient that facilitates the mass movement in the phloem the answer for this question is option c mass flow involving a carrier question number 15 3 pga is first stable product in 3 phosphoglyceric acid is the first stable product of calvin benson cycle or c3 cycle or carbon reduction cycle in this carbon dioxide is utilized for the carboxylation of rubp this reaction is catalyzed by the enzyme rubisco and it results in the formation of two molecules of 3 pga so the answer for this question is option a carbon reduction cycle question number 16 during photo respiration the decarboxylation reaction occurs in in mitochondria glycine that means two molecules of glycine together form serine one molecule and carbon dioxide so the answer for this question is option b mitochondria question number 17 the conversion of glucose to glucose 6 phosphate is catalyzed by During the process of glycolysis glucose and fructose are phosphorylated to give rise to glucose 6 phosphate by the activity of the enzyme exokinase so the answer is option C exokinase question number 18 treatment of seeds at low temperature under moist conditions to break its dormancy is called stratification involves the treatment of seed at low temperature 5 to 10 degrees celsius under sufficiently moist conditions to break its dormancy and to induce germination so the answer is option a stratification question number 19 cytokinins were discovered as kinetin it is a modified form of adenine a yeah, purine it is obtained from the autoclaved herring sperm dna kinetin does not occur naturally in plants search for natural substances with cytokinin like activities lead to the isolation of zeatin from corn kernel and coconut milk since the discovery of zeatin several naturally occurring cytokinins and some synthetic compounds with cell division promoting activity have been identified so the answer for this question is option d kinetin cytokinins were discovered as kinetin question number 20 flocks which are used in the secondary treatment of sewage are flocks are aerobic masses of bacteria associated with fungal filaments forming mess like structures these microbes consume the major part of the organic matter in the effluent reducing its biological oxygen demand so the answer for this question is option d masses of bacteria associated with fungal filaments forming mess like structures are called as flocks question number 21 Which one of the following processes result in the formation of a clone of bacteria? Binary fission that means division in half is a type of asexual reproduction it is the most common form of reproduction in prokaryotes such as bacteria it occurs in some single celled eukaryotes like amoeba and paramecium in binary fission dna replication and segregation occur simultaneously the daughter cells formed as an exact copy of parental dna and they are clones of it so the answer is option b binary fission question number 22 basal part of ovule which lies opposite to micropyle is 
the ovule is integumented megasporangium which is protected by one or more envelope called as integuments integuments encircles the ovule except at micropyle opposite the micropylar end is the sulza representing the basal part of the ovule so the answer is option c sulza question number 23 There are ten flowers in one individual plant of Crotalaria. In each microsporangium of every stamen of all the flowers, there are thirty microspore mother cells. How many pollen grains are formed from the plant? The answer is forty-eight thousand, because every flower of Crotalaria would have ten stamens. Ten stamens would have ten anthers. Ten anthers would have forty microsporangia. Each microsporangia has thirty microspore mother cells. So forty microsporangia would have thousand two hundred microspore mother cells. Each microspore would produce four pollen grains. Taking the number of pollen grains produced by the flower, forty-eight thousand. So the answer for this question is option D, forty-eight thousand. Question number twenty-four. Apomictic embryos in citrus arise from. Apomixis is abnormal kind of sexual reproduction in which egg or other cells associated with egg synergets antipodals etc develop into embryo without fertilization and meiosis development of embryo directly form saprophytic tissues like new cells and integuments is called as adventive embryo that mean adventive embryony which is also a type of apomixis example citrus and mango so the answer is option d maternal sporophytic tissue in ovule question number 25 in down syndrome karyotyping has shown that the disorder associated with trisomy of chromosome number 21 is usually due to down syndrome caused by trisomy 21 arises due to an occasional non disjunction during meiosis when a gamete possesses an extra chromosome that means n plus 1 fusion with a normal gamete produces trisomy so the answer for this question is option c non disjunction during formation of egg cells or sperm cells Question number twenty-six. In garden pea plant, starch synthesis is regulated by capital B and small b alleles. Capital B and small b genotype producers. A single gene product may be produce more than one effect. For example, starch synthesis in pea seed is controlled by one gene. It has two alleles, capital B and small b. Starch is synthesized effectively by capital B, capital B. homozygotes and therefore large starch grains are produced in contrast small b small b homozygotes have lesser efficiency in starch synthesis and produce smaller starch grains after maturation of seeds capital b capital b crossed with small b small b in the first filial generation the offspring is capital b and small b seeds are formed that means intermediate sized seeds were formed these intermediate sized seeds starch grain size is considered as the phenotype then form this angle the allele so incomplete dominance the starch grains producers are intermediate size capital b and small b seeds so the answer for this question is option c intermediate sized round seeds question number 27 Which of the following statement is true for color blindness? Color blindness is a X-linked recessive genetic disorder in which due to recessive allele present on X chromosome pigments are not synthesized by cone cells of Y. The the person is unable to distinguish between the primary color red and green. It occurs more in males than in females. and a carrier female can transfer the defective alleles of 50% of its son so the answer is option c the son of the carrier woman has 50% chances of being color blind 
क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी एट ऑब्जर्व दी फोर क्लासेस गिवन बिलो इन विच दी फॉलोइंग क्लासेस वन इज टू वन वन इज टू वन रेशियो दैट मीन्स वन इज टू वन इज टू वन इज टू वन रेशियो ऑफ प्रोजेनिस इज ऑप्टेन्ड वन इज टू वन इज टू वन इज टू वन इज हाइब्रिड टेस्ट क्रास दैट इज डाई हाइब्रिड टेस्ट क्रास फिनोटाइपिक रेशियो इट इज ऑप्टेन्ड वेन क्रॉसिंग इज डन बिटवीन हाइब्रिड एंड ए रेसेसिव जीनो टाइप वेन टू जीन लोकस इज कंसिडर्ड साइमलटेनियसली सो द आंसर इज ऑप्शन सी बी एंड डी क्रॉसेस ओनली गिवस द रेशियो ऑफ वन इज टू वन इज टू वन इज टू वन क्वेश्चन नंबर ट्वेंटी नाइन विच ऑफ दि फॉलोइंग एम आर नी विल गेट ट्रांसलेटेड कंप्लीटली दि एम आर नी इज ट्रांसक्रैबड पॉली न्यूक्लियोटाइड विच इज लेटेड ट्रांसलेटेड बै रईबोसम यूसिंग टी आर एन टू जॉन अमीनो आसिड्स अंड मेक् प्रोटीन एम आर नी कंटे दि जेनेटिक कॉड विच इज ए सैट आफ इंस्ट्रक्षन दट हेल्प से टू ऑप्टे दि इंफर्मेशन इन मेकिंग प्रोटीन फ्रम दि डी एन दि वर्क आफ Corona and Nirenberg helped decipher the genetic code, which is followed by all organisms in protein synthesis. The codes are always in triplets, that is commonly called as codon, from the sequence of three N bases, that is nitrogen bases, and they are unicellular. A U G triplet is the initiator codon, whose presence is must at the start of the sequence to initiate the translation process so the answer for this question is option c because of the translated sequence is given correctly with start codon and a stop codon question number 30 the distance covered by a complete turn of dna double helix is The DNA double helix can form somewhat different three-dimensional conformations depending on environmental conditions and to some extent on the base sequence. Inside the cell, there are DNA is fully hydrated, a highly regular structure known as B form is adopted. The diameter of B DNA is twenty angstroms, and the distance between base pairs three point four angstroms. Since each helix has ten base pair, the length is approximately thirty-four angstrom. So the answer for this question is option B. Question number thirty-one: The sexual stages of malarial parasite is seen in the malarial parasite requires two hosts, the human and the mosquitoes, to complete its life cycle. The female Anopheles mosquito is vector or transmitting agent during life cycle of Plasmodium. Plasmodium enters the human body as a sporozoite. That means infectious form through the bite of infected female Anopheles mosquito. The parasites initially multiply within the liver cells and then attack the red blood cells, resulting in the rupture. The rupture of RBC is associated with the release of toxic substance hemozoin. which is uh, responsible for the chill and high fever recurring every 3 to 4 days so the answer for this question is option c rbc the sexual stage of malarial parasite is seen in rbc question number 32 todi is produced by todi is also called palm wine is a traditional drink in south india is made by fermenting saffron palms so the answer is option b toddy is produced by the fermentation of saffron palms question number 33 select the correct relationship from the following net primary productivity is commonly called as npp the amount is obtained when the respiration amount is removed from GPP hence NPP equal to GPP subtracted by the energy respiration therefore GPP equal to NPP plus respiration so the answer is option B 
क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी फोर दि प्रासेस् आफ डीग्रेडेशन आफ् ह्यूम अंड रिली आफ इनआर्गानिक न्यूट्रिय बै मैक्रोब्स इज का ह्यूम इज ए डार कलर्ड सबसे रेसिसंट टू मैक्रोबियल आक्शन वे इट इस डीग्रेड्स इनआर्गानिक न्यूट्रिय आर् रिली दिस इज का मिनरलेशन सो द आंसर इज आपशन सी मिनरलेशन क्वेश्चन नंबर थर्टी फाइव The main edible part of coconut fruit is coconut is a type of dwarf fruit. In dwarf, the fibrous part is mesocarp and the stony part is endocarp. The edible part of the coconut is a seed or endosperm. The answer is option A, endosperm. From section A, we have discussed the thirty-five questions. In order from section B, we are going to discuss fifteen questions. Let us discuss one by one. From section B, first question: Morels and agaricas have edible fruiting bodies and belong to the respective class as Morchella. The true morels is a genus of edible sac fungi closely related to anatomically simpler cup fungi belongs to Ascomycetes. Agaricas is an edible fungus and is commonly known as mushroom. It is a saprophytic fungus found growing on soil humus. Decaying litter on forest floors, in the fields and lawns, wood logs and manure piles. Agaricus belongs to Basidiomycetes. So the answer for this question is option A. Ascomycetes and Basidiomycetes, morels and agaricus are the edible fruiting bodies. Belong to the class Ascomycetes and Basidiomycetes. Question number two. Oogamous type of sexual reproduction is found in Oogamy is form of anisogamy it is service called as heterogamy in which the female gamete that is egg cell is significantly larger than the male gamete and is non motile Oogamy is the most advanced form of reproduction with the egg cell or oogonium retained and fertilized on the parental plant so the answer is option b oogamous type of sexual reproduction found in volvox question number 3 the placentation is uh, carnation flower is correctly displayed by which one of the below diagram here there are four diagrams are given see the diagrammatic representation the arrangement of ovules within the ovary is known as placentation The placentation are of different types, namely marginal, axial placentation, parietal placentation, basal placentation, free central placentation. Like that, it is classified into different types. When the placenta is axial and ovules are attached to it in the multilocular ovary, the placentation is said to be axial placentation. That is given in the figure A, as in China rose, tomato, and lemon. When the ovules are born on central axis and septa are absent, as in dianthus, that is otherwise called as carnation, and primrose, the placentation is called as free central placentation. So the second option is correctly given. Dianthus is otherwise called as carnation. So in dianthus, free central placentation is present. You all know the C is marginal placentation, D is parietal placentation. Question number four: The stem with bicolateral vascular bundles and flowers with uh, cyanandrous condition is found in. In bicolateral vascular bundle, xylem is surrounded on both sides by phloem. In cyanandrous stamens. both anther lobes and filaments are fused these conditions are characteristics of cucurbitaceae family so the answer is option c question number 5 match the following see the column 1 and column 2 the column 1 centriole is given so you are all know centriole is a basal body or uh, basal body of cilia or flagella so a is matching with a's chlorophyll 
chlorophyll is present in thylakoid so b is matching with q crista crista is found in the infoldings of mitochondria so c is matching with p ribozyme this matching with r ribozyme is a kind of nucleic acid so the correctly matching option is a question number 6 during which stage in the complete oxidation of glucose is the greatest number of atp molecules produced from adp the total nadh entering in the electron transport system is 10 from glycolysis 2 nadh from linked reactions 6 nadh from krebs cycle ATP formed from 1 NADH is 3 thus ATP formed from 10 NADH is 30 total FADH2 entering in the electron transport system is 2 that is formed from krebs cycle ATP formed from 1 FADH2 is 2 thus ATP formed from 2 FADH2 is totally 4 thus the ATP formed in electron transport system is 34 out of the total 38 produced by complete aerobic respiration of one molecule of glucose so the answer is option d electron transport system question number 7 identify the characters with reference to the plant in which eight nucleated embryo sac was first studied by strasburger Strasburger in the year of 1879 first time described polygonum type of embryo sac on polygonum divericum arthrotopus ovule is found in polygonum it is the simplest and primitive type in which micropyle salaza and funicle lie in one vertical plan monosporic embryo sac only one megaspore nucleus forms embryo sac example polygonum enothera so the answer for this question is option c from the given four statements see the statements totally there are four statements are given characters with reference to the plant in which eight nucleated embryo sac was first studied by strasburger from the four statements first and second is correctly given Question number eight: Holonric traits are gene located on Y chromosome is called as holonric gene, and the traits are called holonric traits, and they are transferred only to all male progeny. So the answer is option A: Y chromosome linked traits. Question number nine: Splicing means. Splicing is the process in which HN RNA undergoes processing to form functional mRNA. HN RNA consists of functional or active segment called exon and non-functional on inactive segment called intron. You know, coding region is called as exon. Non-coding region is called as intron. In splicing, introns are cut and removed. and only the functional exons are joined to form functional mrna so the answer is option a splicing means removal of introns question number 10 the primate given below can be observed in types of ecological primates try to remember primate of number primate of biomass primate of energy generally the pyramid of number usually appear upright manner pyramid of biomass appear upright manner pyramid of energy always appear in upright manner in pyramid of number single tree ecosystem single tree many insects less number of small birds very few large birds that is exceptions pyramid of biomass pyramid of biomass in sea biomass of fishes in more than phytoplanktons that also exceptions 
pyramid of energy there are no exceptions so the answer for this question is option b pyramid of energy without any exceptions question number 11 rubisco enzyme can act both as carboxylase and as oxygenase in c4 cycle it functions as in c4 plants photo respiration does not occur this is because they have mechanism that increases the concentration of carbon dioxide at the enzyme site this uh, takes place when the c4 acid from the mesophyll is broken down in the bundle sheet cells to release carbon dioxide this results increasing the intracellular concentration of carbon dioxide in turn this ensures that the rubisco functions as carboxylase minimizing the oxygenase activity so the answer for this question is option c mainly carboxylase activity minimizing oxygenase question number 12 lysigenous activity in monocot stem vascular bundles developed by the dissolution of there are four types of systems present in monocot stems dermal tissue system hypodermal tissue system ground tissue system and vascular bundle tissue system there are barrel shaped parenchymata cells found in the epidermis trichomes are absent in the monocot stem and below the epidermis there is a layer of hypodermal cells present the ground tissue is undifferentiated in monocot stem which is made up of loosely arranged parenchymata cells there is a vascular bundle which is found scattered in the ground tissue xylem is found on the inner side whereas phloem on the outer side and cambium is absent in monocot stem so the inner protoxylem is non functional and remains water filled this water filled cavity is called as lysigenous cavity or protoxylem cavity or protoxylem lacuna so the answer is option a protoxylem question number 13 Select the incorrect statement about Liliaceae family. Liliaceae is the monocot family in which root is fibrous and leaf shows parallel venation. Flower is bisexual and actinomorphic. Sepals and petals are not distinct and are completely fused as tepals which is generally shows valvate aspiration. So the answer is option A. The incorrect statements are bisexual zygomorphic flowers are given question number 14 match the following and choose the correct options from the below see the column 1 and column 2 meristem is matching with actively dividing cells because of you all know meristematic cells are present at the tip of the root system and the shoot system it undergoes active cell division so a is matching with 3 b is matching with 1 parenchymata cells carry out photosynthesis and storage parenchymata cells with the chlorophyll carry out the process photosynthesis and mainly mainly carry out the process storage so b is matching with 1 colon chyma colon chymata cells provide mechanical support so it is matching with 2 sclerenchyma Sclerenchymata cells are broadly divided into sclerites and fibers. Sclerites are otherwise called as stone cells. So sclerenchyma is matching with sclerites. Epidermal tissue. Epidermal tissues of leaves contain stomata. So it is matching with four. So the correctly matching option is option B. Question number fifteen. Rapid internodal elongation is caused due to which hormone? Gibberellin promotes rapid internodal elongation in genetically dwarf plants. So this phenomena is known as bolting. It is also causes internodal elongation in plants like uh, sugarcane. Thus, it is used to increase productivity of sugarcane. So the answer is option A.